Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to recover some deleted files that you either accidentally deleted or you reformatted over a hard drive or a flash drive. Um, using simple, you know, free recovery tools, you can bring back this information, and it's actually quite easy. So first we have um, the G drive here, which is a one gigabyte flash drive. Um, have some files on there. Uh, let's open them up, make sure everything works. Um, this here is a program, can't really run that yet. Um, this is a video. Today I'm going to show you how to rip a DVD off your computer. Working. Uh, I get this song here. And we have this word file. Get some pictures too. Cat. Christmas lights. Another cat, and I believe this is some snow in the light. Okay, so everything here seems to be working fine. Now we're going to go back here, we're just going to delete it, just a regular delete. Here you want to permanently delete, yes. Alright, so now that's gone. So we're going to check and see if it ended up in the recycle bin, which it didn't. And that's because it was on a flash drive, so it just actually completely deleted it. So now the file is gone. Completely gone, everything's gone. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to this website here. I'll put it in the description. You're going to download this program called Recuva. It's free to download. And you're going to run and install that program. It's been successfully installed. So it's going to come up with this wizard thing. You don't really need the wizard. All you're going to want to do is click all files here, next, and then you want to select the location. Now for me, I'm going to go ahead and select that hard drive. Now it's going to scan that drive only. Then you want to enable deep scan. So now it's doing its thing. Take a couple minutes. Um, seems to have found nine files. Interesting. Fifteen. So the people that make this program are the same people that make the CC cleaner, or C cleaner. Um, she used to clean up certain junk files on a Windows computer. Okay, we have some results here. Let's take a look. This looks like that program I have. That's the video, the song, the the Word document and we have those four pictures. So let's go ahead and restore these and just select them all. You're going to recover. Now the, it's very important not to recover to where the flash drive is. You need to recover to a different spot because you can lose some of the information. So recover. I'm just going to click the desktop. Let's just put it there.
Okay, let's see if these files are working now. <clears throat> here we go, we have four pictures and four other things here. Let's make sure everything's working. We can go ahead and close this. Picture's good. That one's also good as well, as well. Word document opening. Song playing. Today I'm going to show you how to video working. Your computer. And last but not least, this program here. Yep, seems to be working as well. Okay. So that's how you cover files that are just regularly deleted. All right, so let's try this again. Only this time we're going to reformat the hard drive. So we're going to have files on the hard drive, and then we're going to format over top of that. Um, sometimes this happens by accident. You know, I've seen it a couple of times myself. Somebody formats over their hard drive, and they lose everything, or they think they've lost everything. In this case, you really didn't lose everything. So we're going to put the files back on the, the flash drive. Again, just checking to make sure everything's working. Everything's good. All right, so next thing, we're going to reformat that drive right there. <coughs> You're probably going to lose some files. Um, it's going to completely erase all the files. So we're going to format over top it. Format. Uh, I normally just select default. Do a quick format. Formatting will erase all data on disk. To format disk, click OK. So, bang. All right, format complete. Now we look there, there is nothing on there at all. So we're going to go ahead and open up the Recuva program again and see if it can bring back our files. All files, select the drive location, the same as before. Next, enable deep scan. Start. Now it should take some time again. All right, let's see what we got. Looks like all the files are here. Um, we have the program, the video file, the song, uh, a Word document, and four pictures. So we're going to go ahead and recover all these. And we're just going to put it in the desktop again. I do stress that you do not recover the same drive that they came from because that will lead to some file corruption. So we're going to recover them there and then see how everything works. All right, so here's that folder I put everything in. Picture, working, 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 working. Video seems to be working. Song seems to be working. 
And the Word document also seems to be working. <clears throat> So that is how you would recover deleted files. Um, now I can show you another program that can also do this. Um, when I first ran the test, there was some corruption after the reformat. But in this case, the video file um, is working properly. So I don't have to worry about it. But um, just because, I'd like to show you guys another program. This one is a, a pay version. Um, it seems a little bit more user friendly with the interface, but uh, it seems to work just as well, maybe a little bit better than the free Recuva version. It's called Ease US Data Recovery Wizard. They also make a, like a mobile recovery wizard as well. So I'm going to delete all these. Okay, everything's in the recycle bin. Gonna empty that. All right, so there's still nothing on this hard drive here. Not a thing. So here's the program here. Um, you can scan by certain types of files, just like with Recuva. I'm gonna do all file types, click next. Then I'm gonna select the drive here. Right here, Recuva. Scan it. Um, it's going to take a few minutes because it's also going to run a deep scan. So you didn't find anything. So now it's going to do the deep scan. This offers a little better way to sort these files. Um, this program, like I said, the interface is a little bit more easy to file. It, it goes by dates. You can file by type. You know, there's, there's just many ways to do it. So this looks like the video here. It's just get some camera photos here. So there's actually 18 files that I've found. So we're going to recover them all, and then we'll see, see exactly exactly what's there for us. As long as all right, so we have some files here. Let's test them out. Word document is good. The song song is good. Video still works, it's good. Um, as long as this program, yep, yeah, looks like the program still functions and all the pictures are good as well. So that's exactly how you would recover deleted files. Um, this is a service that you would pay hundreds of dollars, dollars for normally if you took it to you know, a repair shop. But uh, this is something you could do at home quite easily on your own. So next time you run into this issue, just look up this video and you'll know exactly what to do.